we would like to specially mention that entire poor people of Karnataka stand with the Congress party and middle class people also. Our leadership, Congress President, Madam Sonia Gandhi, Rahul Gandhi, Priyanka Gandhi, and all our chief ministers and senior leaders work very hard to make this victory as a reality. I sincerely thanking our Honorable Congress President who actually spent one month continuously for election campaign and monitoring. Actually, this gado of victory is was initiated by through Bharat Jodo Yatra by Rahul Gandhi ji. The energy to the cadre has been started at that point of time itself. Sincerely thanking, he also spent lot many days for campaign. And we are thanking Rahul Gandhi also for his sincere campaigning and guidance. Madam Priyanka ji, also extensively toured her show show was big hit in Karnataka and I would like to mention I would like to thank Priyanka Gandhi ji also on this regard of course Madam Sonia Gandhi's advice and the presence in the campaign strengthened Our prospectors strengthened our carder, electrified our carder. There, there is no word to thanks, Madam Sonia Gandhi also. Brothers, sisters, of course we got a mandate on 13th evening. 14th evening itself we had a CLP meeting. Honorable Congress President deputed three observers to attend that CLP meeting and their night of 14th and till morning of 15th they took a one to one hearing from the MLAs each and every MLAs of Congress party and finally they given a report to Congress president on 15th night our party is a democratic party you know that we believe in consensus not in dictatorship Last two, three days, yes, we are trying for a consensus. You know that. Karnataka, we had good dynamic leaders. Very good chunk of leaders are there in Karnataka for the Congress party. Sidharamaya, you know, an experienced senior most politician, an able administrator, He has contributed a lot for this election for the party. Tirelessly he worked for the party throughout the state. The same way our PCC president D.K. Shukumar, one of the dynamic party organizers in the state, he electrified the cadre of the state. Wherever little gap is there, he reached there and filled the gap. You know, it was a very good combination as Shivkumar as a PCC and Siddharamaya as a CLP leader. Both are big assets of the Congress party in Karnataka. Of course, everybody have their own wish, their own desire to become a CM. They deserve it also. Both deserve it also. The Congress President had a series of consultation with the senior leaders and one-to-one -one discussion with Siddharamaya ji and Shiv Kumar. We are all the part of that discussions. And two, he took opinion from Madam Sonia Gandhi, Rahul Gandhi and Priyanka ji. 
and other senior leaders. Finally, Congress President took a decision on Karnataka's CLP leader issue. He conveyed me, he authorized me to convey his decision, Congress President decisions to the media, to, through the media, to the people of Karnataka and the nation. He decided to make Siddharamaya as the Chief Minister of Karnataka. Siddharamaya will be the Chief Minister of Karnataka. D.K. Shivkumar will be the only one Deputy CM of Karnataka. He will continue as a PCC president till the parliament election is over. Already we are having a CLP meeting in the evening at Bangalore to formally elect CLP leader. 20th day after tomorrow, 12.30 is the swearing in ceremony. Along with the Chief Minister and Deputy Chief Minister, a group of ministers also will be sworn in that day. Okay, thank you.